And welcome back, everyone. Using social media like Facebook and uh, my favorite, Twitter, can be a lot of fun, and it's a great way to pass time. But social media can also help your business. Joining me this morning is a business owner who knows that firsthand, Dave Hatter of Libertas Technology. Dave, how you doing? Good, Rob. How are well, you? How, can, how does it make your business better? How can you potentially make more money by using social media? Well, there's several ways, but one of the main ways is it gives you exposure. It uh -huh. gives you reach to people you wouldn't normally be able to have access to. You can build connections. You can use it for prospecting purposes. Right. Uh, I would say at least once a month now, I'll get a lead off LinkedIn. Someone who's found me through LinkedIn who and learns more about our business and what we can do. So, it, it, for example, the Link Cincinnati group on LinkedIn right. has over 23,000 people in it. So you've got a permission-based marketing group where people have opted in. They joined on their own. There's people sharing all kinds of information, like people might go in there and talk about the upcoming beer week you sure, guys just sure. talked about. And they can expose that information to 23,000 plus people who've expressed an interest in Cincinnati. Okay, now he's going to be teaching a class at Cincinnati State. It happens on Friday. We're going to have more information. But what we're going to do is break down the four classes, correct? Yeah, sounds great. Um, first of all, who should attend these classes? Really anyone who wants to learn more about social media and how they can use it to improve their business. That's okay. really the main focus of it. It's through the workforce development center at Cincinnati State. The first one is introduction. What will they learn during that first class? Um, that's really geared, all of these are geared to be hands-on workshops. Uh -huh. It's going to be where you can come and really kind of understand what I like to call the big four. Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Google Plus. What they do, how they work. Think a little bit about strategy. You know, why would you use these? Which one might be the right one for you? That kind of thing. What's awesome is you put workshop in every single one of these titles. The connection workshop because it does take hands-on to learn how to do it. it whether it, you're from your phone or your iPad right. or from your computer. It really does. These, these will be using the, um, the, the computers at Cincinnati State up at the Workforce Development Center so people will be able to come in, sit right. down in front of a computer and work with people like myself who work with these technologies every day. Content creation workshop, that's critical because people don't want to feel like all you're trying to do is sell them on something. That's, Rob, that is what I think one of the most significant points. And a lot of people don't, you know, they don't really know what to say or what to do. Right. And so trying to figure out, you know, what is your message? What can you share with people? How can you build trust and influence without seeming like you're trying to sell them something right. all the time? How can you get something useful out to them and provide value? Case study workshop. Yeah, that's, I think, going to be the most interesting one. What we're going to do is bring in some experts and, and look at some real-world case studies, well-known ones that you could find yourself, right. and then some personal items that, you know, things we've encountered along the way. Because although this can be really powerful, it can also be really negative. You know, right. when things go viral, it could be something negative. You need to know what are people saying about you out there? Are you getting return on investment? So we're going to look at some real-world examples, and then we're going to talk about how you can apply those to what you're trying to do, what to do, and what not to do. Because when, you have, when you're a consumer and you have a complaint, if you call their complaint line, you might not get any kind of reaction from them. But if you post something negative on their Facebook page where all their followers or uh, friends can see it, they act much more quickly. Typically, and, and sometimes they don't act at all, and that creates an even bigger problem. Right. Because if, if people say something negative about you, first off, you ought to know about it, right? If you don't even know they're doing right. it, that's a problem. And then if you don't react, well, it kind of just proves the point that there really must be something wrong. So it is a great way to go in and try to mitigate problems and show people you do care, you are interested in customer service, and that you want to resolve people's problems in and, the business. And the reason why this is different than advertising is because it's not passive. These people have opted that's right. in, that's so right. they're already part of your base, yeah, correct? It, that's right. It's not passive, it's active, and you can make it as active as you want. You can proactively share information. You can use it as a way not only to help people understand what you're doing, but to resolve customer complaints and, and help people get connected with one another and share information and solve their own problems in and, any case. And this, I would say the, the benefit is, is two parts. They're going to learn more, but the other parts are going to be in a room with like-minded people. That's right. Uh, with other people with similar experiences, yeah. you can ask questions. Again, we want this to be very interactive, very dynamic. We want people to come with questions, and we want them to ask those questions and, and really help them understand how to use this to make their business better. We're going to put some information up on your screen. It's, it's Fridays at 8.30. There are four classes. The first one on February 3rd, next on the 10th, the 23rd of March, right. and then the 30th of March. Each class is 69 bucks, but you can take all four for 229 bucks. You can find out more information at our website. Fox19.com. Did you ever think of a day like this no. where we'd be using social media no, to I talk didn't. to our friends I and really sell didn't. things? It's, it's pretty incredible. It's, I can just tell you from my own personal experience, it, it, LinkedIn in particular, but all these tools have been very powerful for my business. I'm getting jobs from it. And it wasn't that long ago that Dave and I sat here and talked about how we, we didn't want a smartphone because they were too big. That's right. Too big, <laughs> too clunky, too heavy. Now you can't live without it. It's no, like a wallet. Can't. It would be tough. All right. Dave Hatter of Libertas Technology. Continued success. Thanks, Rob.